that God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son Jesus to come and die on the cross for our sins because man sinned and because of that sin the only way his sin could be forgiven by the father was through the shedding of blood but not the shedding of blood of anyone but of someone that was perfect someone who had never sinned so God the son came and took the likeness of man came lived experience what it means to be man but yet did not sin was tempted like us but yet did not sin because of that his sacrifice was made acceptable to the father and by his death on the cross he took on our sin so now we are reborn in him we are made children of god so that is the message that we're supposed to share and from that on we are taken away from death we are taken away from hell we are taken away from the destructive hands of the enemy which is lucifer the devil and because of that our names are written in the book of life and the joy that that brings to us on earth greater joy will be in heaven when we will be reunited with all other believers throughout the world celebrating the majestic presence glorious of Jesus and because of the presence of the Holy Spirit he give us dominion over our flesh to help us walk a holy life and if we do stumble and fall and do end up sinning that we have Christ our advocate to the Father who is willing to forgive our sins that's the gospel that is what is found in Jesus it's not through our works but it's through our positioning it's because it's freely given to us because of Jesus dying on the cross so that is the message that every believer need to share to someone.